you were lucky. We'll meet again. Snake, are you okay? Snake! Major. Snake. Are you all right? You're not hurt? No. That was a hell of a drop, but I'm fine. Looks like there's no way back up, though. I see. Well, anyway, it's good to hear you're not injured. Slipping and falling may not have been part of the plan, but getting into that cave was. Proceed further into the cave. The cave seems to be structured like a maze, but there's an exit somewhere. Find a way out of the cave and head for the aqueduct. All right, but it might take me a while to get through this cave. Are you hurt? No. Is it the enemy? Did they set a trap for you? Not that either. Then what is it? It's dark in here. Dark? Yeah, there's no light anywhere. I should have brought a flashlight with me. So what you're saying is that it's going to take you a while because you don't have a flashlight? Right. Snake, if you don't have a flashlight, you should be looking for a substitute. I tell you, American soldiers these days rely too much on ready-made equipment. Here we go again. What was that? Nothing. American soldiers rely too much on ready-made equipment. And not only that, they can't seem to grasp that one piece of equipment can have multiple functions. Back when I was in the SAS, we never had that problem. We were trained to use every piece of equipment in as many ways as possible. If you don't have a flashlight, look for something else. You need to develop flexible, innovative thinking if you want to... Hey, are you listening to me? Yeah, of course I am. First, take a look at what you're carrying with you now. Don't you have anything that can provide you with some light?
We are the sons of the boss! I am the pain! I will guide you to a world of anguish beyond your imagination!